What's up everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now Plus. I'm Alex and in this video, a little Dead by Daylight news. We kind of knew this was coming, right? This didn't come as a massive surprise. I guess as long as you keep track of the Dead by Daylight leaks over on Twitter. But we got the official confirmation today that Albert Wesker is going to be the new killer. And then Ada Wong and Rebecca Chambers are the two survivors. Very, very cool. The first time, obviously, we've had this where uh, collaboration has had a sequel to it, right? We already had the Resident Evil uh, part one we can call it maybe we can call this part two I guess it's called Resident Evil Project W and it also is going to be resulting in the Raccoon City Police Department the map is splitting into two the main hall is going to be a consistent thing in both of the maps but they're kind of redoing it and splitting it up very very exciting um, I, I've been playing Dead by Daylight for a very very long time I actually haven't played it recently I haven't played oh god probably the last three or four uh, crossovers you know the, the last three or four probably additional to the game but I'm a, a huge huge fan of it and I think Resident Evil what they already did with Resident Evil I thought was one of if not the best collaborations they've ever done my personal favorite I think will always be Scream having Ghostface in it but you know having the the first Resident Evil uh, crossover was awesome this one I honestly think is pr well at least right now I kind of feel like it's better uh, I love Wesker I think Wesker is a phenomenal character the Resident Evil 5 Wesker uh, it says he'll have superhuman speed and will uh, be able to to infect his victims of course you know you're, you're just gonna have to make this different and you always have this case with dead by daylight killer has to be pretty unique i really don't doubt that they can make wesker unique and then the survivors are gonna have to be unique and they don't as far as i know they didn't go too much into it they talk about ada is a, a valuable ally but only if your interests remain aligned and then chambers will go to great lengths to save a teammate in need so maybe some sort of protection kind of thing for rebecca or when you unhook somebody something you know i mean there is already abilities for that but something else and then for ada only if your interests remain aligned maybe like if you match uh, perks with other survivors you get some sort of buff or something I, they can do probably some pretty wild stuff with uh with both of them but their character models they look fantastic really really exciting so let me know what you guys think in the comments make sure you guys are subscribed bell icon turned on and i'll see you all on the next video